Welcome back to the channel. I'm back with another set of eShop deals to tell you about, featuring some awesome indie games, more brand new low prices from Bandai Namco, and yes, I'll tell you about that second half of the Mario Day sale. So make sure to hang on and subscribe to the channel as I tell you about some awesome Nintendo Switch eShop deals. <laughs> Let's kick off today's video with some awesome indie games, including some I'm betting you never heard of before. Super Cyborg is a hidden gem, especially for those who love the old school Contra games. It's a run and gun game where you are a cyborg tasked with saving humanity while blowing up hordes of alien life forms. Featuring nice retro style graphics with excellent boss battles within seven awesome levels to plow through and even co-op play, Super Cyborg is a treat and one that you need to pick up. Trust me on this. It's on sale for $2.79, it's lowest price ever on the eShop until April 3rd. The first Blossom Tales game was a winner from the early days of the Switch eShop, featuring solid gameplay inspired by the Legend of Zelda series. It's no surprise, it was a hit with Nintendo fans. The long-awaited sequel, Blossom Tales 2, takes everything players loved about the first game and ramps it up a bit with a game that is twice the size of the original, with lots of narrative gameplay, as well as plenty of choices that will influence the story and various events as you play. It's a solid indie title, and if you love the first one, or love top-down exploration games like the 2D Legend of Zelda games, then you'll find a lot to love in this game. It's on sale for $10.49 at its lowest price ever on the eShop until March 28th. Continuing on with some good pixel art games, No Gravity Games has a sale going on on arguably their four best games in that style. Okinara Rush is a side-scrolling beat-em-up style game where players use fighting game mechanics and attacks to diss out the pain to foes. It's a lot of fun, I love the gameplay, and I love the local co-op mode this game has. Those who have access to a European or a Japanese eShop account, there is a demo on those eShops, so give it a go if you're curious. But in the meantime, it's just $3.99 on the eShop, which is a steal. Get it if you love beat em up style games or action games in general. Tanuki Justice is an old school style run and gun game where you play as a ninja Tanuki as you face off against hundreds of enemies. It's very reminiscent of those late 80s arcade style games. This game also has a local co op mode too, so if you have a player too who wants to get in on some old school action, then for just $2.99, it's a good get. That's the lowest price it's ever been on the eShop. Valachia Reign of Dracula is an old school style game that is in the same style as the early Castlevania games. So there's no Metroidvania action here, but that's okay. The older style Castlevania games are still awesome nevertheless. What's neat about this game is instead of the character using a traditional weapon like a sword or a whip, the lead character uses a bow and arrow in such a way that the game becomes a bit of a run and gun game. I like it, I like that style, and if you like those older style Castlevania games, then for just $2.99, it's worth peeking into, especially since that's the new lowest price has ever been on the eShop. Finally, there's Golden Force, a tough as nails action platformer that will test your skills, but for those who are looking to tackle the challenge, will be treated to some good, rewarding combat and some awesome bosses to face. Again, huge emphasis here, it is a tough game, but it is fair. It's on sale for $3.99, a brand new low price from the eShop, and just like the other no gravity games on sale, it'll be on sale until April 11th. Those who love platformers might want to take a look at Demon Turf. It's got a neat art style, taking elements from 2D games and incorporating it into a 3D space. There's plenty of levels and challenge and exploration to be had in this game for those who love those games. It's just a neat stylized game from its visuals to its gameplay and humor that it really stands out from the crowd from other games in the genre. Those looking to pick it up on sale, it's at a brand new low price on the eShop of $14.99 until March 28th. Now Bandai Namco has a few new sales going on with some brand new lows for their games. 
Mr. Driller, Drill Land, is the latest entry in the Auction Puzzle Game series for the Switch. You need to dig as fast as you can while not getting squished and scoring as many points as possible. There's plenty of modes to enjoy in this one, including local and online multiplayer play. So for those looking to get back into the series, or to play their first Mr. Driller game, well this is a good place to start. To top it off, it's on sale for a brand new low price of $5.99, which is a sweet price for it, until April 3rd. Oh and there is a demo on the eShop too, so feel free to check that out. I love the Tokyo games and Rhythm Festival. The latest game is a winner with so many songs to enjoy. Now the physical release out there can normally go for about 25 to 30 bucks, but with the library of songs this game has, I'd say digital is the way to go for just ease of access. The deluxe edition is on sale for $39.59, and that just might be the ticket, as not only does it include a 90-day pass, to the song catalog of over 500 songs, on top of their nearly 80 included in the game. It also includes a ton of extra DLC songs, every single one that has been released for the game so far. Holy cow, that's just insane. If you love rhythm games, or you love this series, 40 bucks is a steal for the amount of content you get in the deluxe edition. Those looking to pick up Dragon Ball Z, Kakarot for the Switch can now the Deluxe Edition with the Trunks DLC expansion for just $29.99. That is the lowest price it's ever been on the eShop, and it's probably the way to go if you just want to enjoy the game with some extra goodies without breaking the bank. The last game from Bandai Namco isn't at a brand new low price, but it is just an alert for those who have the Namco Museum Archives Volume 1 or picked it up earlier this month when it was on sale. The second half, Volume 2, is on sale for 5 bucks as well, and if you like the first volume, then it's a no-brainer to get the second. It features some awesome faves, like Galaga, Mappy Land, Rolling Thunder, and more. 11 NES and Famicom classics for just 5 bucks. Now let's talk about that second half of the Mario Day sale. Yes, Mario Day ended a few weeks back, but Nintendo has done something different this year with its celebration of all things Mario compared to previous years. Instead of just a day or a few days, they've turned it into a whole month of discounts. Their first half of the sale is now over, and from now until April 8th, they have another set of games on discount. Now I want you to keep in mind that while this video is focused on eShop stuff, Lots of big retailers like Best Buy, Amazon, GameStop, and Walmart are getting in on the sale action with discounts on the same Mario games for both their digital and physical copies at the same price as the eShop sale. And in some cases like Walmart, they're doing it for a few bucks cheaper. So yeah, if you don't mind using those retailers, you can not only get some extra gold coins back for buying digital from them, but if you want a physical copy, you can have it for the same price. Like I said before, always looking out for those who collect physical Switch games too. Now the games on sale are as follows. Super Mario 3D World, plus Bowser's Fury, Super Mario Odyssey, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe, and Super Mario Maker 2 are on sale for $39.99 each on the eShop. Again, you should be able to pick up the same games at those same prices at stores like Best Buy, GameStop, Walmart, and Amazon if you go that route. If you don't have any of these games, or you're curious on what the best deal might be of the bunch, I'd say that would go to Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury. The Switch release is the newest one of those games, and also, it doesn't nearly drop down to 40 bucks or so, or go on sale as much as the other games on the list, so that's just something to keep in mind. And there you go, that's today's updates on the latest eShop deals you need to know about. Now of course there's lots of other good games at discount beyond these games today, so if you missed any of my coverage in the past week or so, well don't worry, I got links to all those videos down below in the comments and at the end of this video for you to click on to get yourself updated and in the know. 
If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure to click on the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you can stay up to date with new videos and content that comes out every week on this channel. Anyway, that's all from me today. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll catch you next time. Thank you.